Hello, welcome to episode one of Nigel's Vegan Cook Shop. By the way, all of this is gonna be live. There will be no redos, no retakes. So what you see is what you get. Today we're gonna to be making stuffed peppers. The first thing you do, wash your hands. You guys know what time we're in right now. Please wash your hands. Now that we've done that, first step will be get your peppers. Wanna get these peppers washed, cleaned, sliced, and diced. Now what you wanna do is cut them. Probably go from This way, so you know you have two nice big halves to uh, to cut it in. So you know that's what uh, that's what I'm going to do. Then you want to scoop out those insides and. sink. Take your peppers in a lightly oiled pan and set them in there so they can get a little, uh, you know, a little steam treatment so they can be nice and prepared. And I'm taking my, uh, Taking my peppers that were cut in the best condition to stuff with. I didn't do a fantastic job cutting all of them, but you know, the ones I did will be used. The others will be put into the mix. So now that that's done, put these in the oven for about 15 minutes. Next step would be to cut the rest of the vegetables that are going that are going to be stuffed into the pepper. Pro tip: my mother always taught me, clean as you go. So here I go. Got an onion to peel and some garlic. Got cucumber or not? What is this? This is zucchini. Got some mushrooms, which I really hate, but they're good for you, so I'm gonna put it in there. And then my Lithuania isn't great, but I can tell you these are sprouts. They're very healthy. And while that's going on, we'll be boiling some rice to be stuffed in. First, for the onion. And for how much I'm using, I don't know, I mean, just a, what is this, small onion, if you will. This little garlic guy, probably use like five or six of these. I really like garlic, you can use less. Um, uh, these are about yay big, so I'll maybe use like five or six of these. Uh, I really like these, they're kind of tasteless, so it really doesn't matter, but eat your vegetables, eat your greens. So I'll probably use, you know, half a little more of that, and then they, uh, you know, get help in these just to throw in there, because again, these guys are quite healthy. And mix in my leftover pepper friends who didn't get selected. That's okay though. All winners in the end. Next, time to cut down here. Say chew bubble gum so you don't cry, but you know, I don't know. It just doesn't matter. But, you know, cut, cut, cut your onion. Do, do what you need to do. Take 
take the peppers out, let these guys sit down. They're not going to be needed, you know, for a little bit. Put these guys to rest. <sighs> Our rice is boiling. Now it's time to put the bag of rice in. Time to cut up some mushrooms. This is nice. It's gonna be gross. Next up, time to cook our veggies. Things are going pretty well right now. Check on the rice. The rice is the rice is rising. It's doing what it's supposed to do. It's good. It's good. 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 Now we're going to cook some of these veggies, get them soft so they can be used in the pepper. And uh, you know, we're cooking with gas now, moving them along pretty nicely. This recipe is Italian, so I'm going to add. Metallic cheese and garlic. I know it's like, oh my gosh, you already cut garlic. I like garlic. You know, sorry. Now, it's time to cook. Sauce. Yeah, I, I might just use me use a lot. Yeah. Yeah, that was the whole jar. Yeah. Just use just use the whole jar. Also going to add some of this in here. They go, oh my gosh, you're vegan. Where do you get your protein from? Soy mints is because it gives the um, the illusion of you know a meaty taste. So if you stuff peppers with you know ground beef or ground whatever you want to use, you know I get the same effect minus the cow. So everyone wins. various veggies finished mixed together we have our pasta sauce soy mince to give this like a uh, ground beef <laughs> if you will now it's time to stuff our little peppers that have been just chilling over there and now comes the arts and craft time Now it's time to clean up while we wait. And 
now it's time to see what it's talking about. Absolutely fantastic. I give myself a pat on the back. It's delicious. Thank you guys for tuning in. All of this stuff you saw was, you know, no cutting, no editing. I want you to see actually what happens. You know, we're not one of these, you know, bougie fake cooking shows where we cut off stuff and make it look all perfect. This is the real deal. This is what happens when you cook for real. Thank you for joining me. Now, uh, leave me alone while I go uh, finish. <laughs>